my parents' house in uh, Vienna, Virginia. It's like a small suburb outside of DC. Uh, I've grown up here since uh, 1993. I started riding uh, here actually in this backyard when I was uh, 10. Uh, I was into BMX. I was into everything, like every kind of extreme sport. And I, you know, I saw kids like like jumping down stairs and like doing tail whips and it just like blew me away. I was like, that is, I want to do that, you know. So I just picked up a scooter and I've been riding ever since. Like all my friends started skateboarding and I met a lot of local skaters and they showed me around. We would go down downtown, take the metro train down to DC and I just came like tied with a bunch of skateboarders and that's kind of how I guess I got my style, you know. So yeah, that's how I've gotten my inspiration. <laughs> I moved down to Richmond. It's uh, like an hour and a half south of uh, DC. I moved there for art school. I kind of always been like, you know, close to filming because of uh, like scootering, you know, making videos. So I chose to do that kind of route. So I've been studying film for the past three years. Uh, a typical day. Oh, I spend the summer, so usually you just wake up kind of late, you know, noon, one, and then uh, it's really hot down here in the summer, it's like so humid, so we would just kind of go to the river for a couple hours, chill out, and then by the time it gets kind of like dusk, we go like warm up and try and go hit some spots like in the city or wherever, you know. I just love street riding so much more because, I mean, parks are fun, you know, it's always awesome to go just like, kick, you know, flow around, but it's just not the same as you know you driving around and you see a spot and it's there's like you know it's not perfect it's you have to like work with it and you know sometimes it can be like really scary and but when you like do it and you land it and yeah it's maybe more creative you like think and you know you can I don't know just make you know every sport you know you think about BMX or skateboarding they've had like the rise and the fall you know and so. I think we might have one soon and you know it's just gonna depend on you know if everyone's committed and you know loves riding then there's no reason why it will just die out you know it'll stay it'll stay a sport you know at this point I'm kind of unsure of what the future is gonna be that but my main plan right now is uh, moving to California I'm gonna try and get you know get more involved in the scooter scene and actually like, work you know, in a shop and try and like see what the business is like because I want to stay in it and I want to try and maybe do something someday. And still ride. Yeah, still ride, of course. Like, you know, I'll never start riding until I like, I can ride, but I want to, you know, I want to do more than just ride. I want to help. Yeah.